What is going on YouTube? It's been a little while, um, but I'm excited to be here nonetheless because today's a special video. Even though every video we do together is pretty special, but uh, it's pretty cool because I'm in my new apartment. And uh, it's pretty cool, you know, got the kitchen. And this apartment's cool because, well, for me at least, um, because it's my first apartment that I have had by myself. Because in the past I've had like roommates and in college I had roommates and in the past few years I've had roommates. And I love roommates, but um, I think it's an important time for me to, I guess, take another step in life and live on my own. Because you, you learn a lot when you live on your own and also when you're by yourself more. That's when a lot of people don't like to be by themselves because it's, uh, what is it? It's less comfortable for them. It makes them feel uneasy, but that's when you're most vulnerable, right? And that's when you learn the most. So don't be afraid to, if you have roommates, that's cool, but don't be afraid to um, or if you live with the parents, that's cool too, because I used to. Um, if you don't have like a lot of free time for yourself, try to make free time, because it's good to have time alone for yourself, because like I said, you learn the most then, and you're, you're also, you might be able to be the most creative then, because you, you're in a different th thought process when there's no one around you. But we got the, I got a couch there. Um, it's got like this little L shape, it's kind of cool. Got my, uh, some photo stuff right there. Got the TV, the kitchen, and let's go outside here, check this out. Um, this is pretty cool. Got the pool. When it's not too foggy, you can see the mountains. I saw the mountains last week when I checked out the place, but you can see the mountains right there. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Pretty, pretty simple, that's all I really need. But uh, I'm gonna take you guys with me to the gym. We're gonna go to the gym right now. Actually, before the gym, do I have time? Before the gym, I'm gonna get a little snack, a little snack of root, and uh, like a pre-workout kind of meal, and I'll, I'll show you what I get. Okay, I lied. I, I said I was gonna show you something to eat, but the place I went to was closed, so instead I'm just getting right to it. I already warmed up, warmed my shoulders, jump ropes, did some air squats. You guys already know, warm up my whole body before I do any type of workout, but starting with bench press right now, right here. There's Trent, say what up Trent. Say hi, Trent. Trent's not good in front of people. He, he gets, no, I'm kidding. Trent's really good in front of people. Wait, but uh, yeah, we're gonna start with bench press here. Just with 25s, and we're gonna add 25s. Keep going up, and then come back down. But uh, yeah, let's check it out. So it's pretty easy. I'm doing a, I'm doing five pause to five uh, regular reps. So I'm gonna do this and keep going up, and then I'll probably do set to five after that. That was uh, 225 on each side, so what is that? 145. So I'm gonna do that for another set. The same, still warm up steps, five pause, five regular. Uh, and I'm gonna get, go up to three 25s on each side, then four, and then we're gonna come back down. So it's a pyramid up, pyramid down. We're at three 25s on each side now. We're gonna do this for 10 regular reps. I'm only gonna do 10, two sets of 10. Um, not pause, so not five pause, five regular, just 10 regular. And then I'm gonna, from there we're gonna get four 25s on each side, so I think that's 245, and see how many we can get for there. But uh, yeah, and I'm going up by 25s because honestly I like warming up with 25s. I used to go up 45 and then take, take a 45 off and then try to put a 10 on, and then like, for me it's easier to do this. So if it's easier for you to do this, give it a shot. If you're way stronger, you do like, you go up by 45s, that's awesome too, but I'm not that strong, so. And what I mean by not that strong, it's relative in my terms because for me, like my squat and deadlift have a bigger number, uh, way bigger number than my bench press. In terms of like, 
percentages wise. Like I should be able to bench 215 for how much I squat, but I can't. So something I need to work on. But uh, yeah, bench has always been my worst lift, so let's, let's get better today. Okay, so that was my top set. That was super hard for me. Trying to how to spot me at then. And also, I did like four, four and a half, because he helped me. But uh, don't do what I did. I think my butt came off a little bit off the bench. Keep your butt planted. Don't do what I did. But just try your hardest, but don't do what I did. All right, so we did that top set. Shit was hard, should be hard for you. Try to max out like four or five reps. You know, that last fifth rep, your spotter should help you, if you got one. Um, so I'm dropping it back down to 325 on each side, so I'm gonna do as many reps as possible, as many reps as possible, as many reps as possible. So if you're gonna do something, you could, your first one you can get around 10, 10 and 12, eight to 12, and then from that it's just, you're dropping it, dropping it, dropping it. So 10 and then maybe like five to 10 and then five to 10 reps after that. So let's get this. I think I got nine, eight to ten first one, and then I got five, and then another like six or seven on the last one. Wasn't even counting. But uh, we're gonna do that for two sets. So I just finished that. I'm gonna do, well, I'm gonna recover now for full recovery. So three, five minutes, if it takes you seven minutes to recover, take, take that time, and then hit it again hard, as hard as you can with as many reps for three sets, or three drop sets, right? Okay, so after the bench, that was tiring. Oh, I should catch, oh, I should catch my breath before I start the video, but too late. So we did the rows, C row uh, for 12, that's easy. Not super hard, not super easy. And then what we're doing is what you just saw is the push-ups. So you're doing four push-ups and on the fifth, you're doing a explosive push up So if you can do triple clap, awesome. If you can do four claps, awesome. If you can do one clap, awesome. If you can do no claps, then try to get your hands off the ground. The idea is going from normal pull-ups to a ballistic pull-up. So we do four, and on the fifth, um, 
be as, as, as explosive and as dynamic as you can and do that for three, three times in one set. Or we do that for three sets, this whole thing, right? So the rows and the push-ups, three sets. quick workout I'm done but that last set of exercises was why is it so dark the last set of exercises was uh you saw was the standing military dumbbell press right our uh, uh, shoulder press one arm and you're gonna do 10 on each arm and then right into that you're gonna go into 10 muscle-ups if you can't do 10 muscle-ups you're gonna do 10 pull-ups if you can't do 10 pull-ups do 10 assisted pull-ups have someone either help you or use the assistant machine or use a band right and we're gonna do five five sets yep five sets Good amount of sets. You're gonna be tired after this, even though it's only three, you know, three sets of exercises: bench, and then the the row to push-ups, and then this. You're gonna be tired. Um, but I'm super duper hungry, and I'm really tired because I spent all day moving yesterday into my apartment, as you guys saw before earlier in the video. But right now, I'm gonna take you guys with me to go eat. So you're about to see what I'm about to eat and right about now. And that's the food. That's the magical food I'm going to eat. I'm so tired, I'm pretty depleted because I did uh, it's kind of like almost a fasted workout. I just had uh, some caffeine in my system. I had a decent workout, it was solid, but I definitely need this food. So this, this place is called Kava. If you're ever in the village, or they, they have it in different areas, but if you look up Kava, there's in, uh, they have it in different areas. If it's by you, try it. And don't drop your fork like I did right there. I'll probably get a new one. I'm gonna get a new fork, bro. Um, yeah, I just dropped it. But no, it's, it's rice, chicken. I got some like tahini, hummus. So it's pretty clean. It's pretty good, pretty clean, pretty tasty. It's all the above. It's, it's a, it's a one-stop shop for all your food needs. Does that make sense? You stay pretty healthy, you stay pretty lean, you stay pretty happy, you stay pretty icy, you stay pretty saucy. You stay everything, you know? And that's it for today. Um, I'll catch you guys on the next workout vlog.